Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here at the start of a new campaign in the Great War mod, and of course, Hearts of Iron 4, playing as that Kingdom of Italy. So, like all campaigns, some custom game rules, everything's going to be random, except that I'm going to leave on historical AI, just because I want to make sure we eventually get into some conflict with the Ottoman Empire. But, a couple mods I'm using, Stage Chancellor Tool Mod, Parallel Peace Conferences, Colored Buttons, Colored Events, and of course... The Great War submod for Hearts of Iron 4. Now, Italy does have quite a unique focus tree. I do want to eventually go down to Colonial Ambition. At the time of this recording, right now, I am not sure whether we should do a reapproachment with the Entente or with Germany, but we might decide that by the end of this video. Maybe, maybe not. But what I do know is that we have we can do early industrialization, and then we can get quite a bit of civilian factory construction speed. So let's do early industrialization. I love the description. Great. Uh, how many research slots? Three. That's okay. It's actually been a while from this recording, uh, since the last recording of me playing this mod. Let's see. That looks good. Uh, that's a little bit too ahead of time. Planes would be nice. We already have early fighters. That's actually pretty good. Uh, that can wait. And we gotta think of a navy as well. Mm, if we, we'll probably not do carriers. We'll probably do battleships. We could do some of this stuff. We are on Grand Battle Plan. You know what? Let's stay with Grand Battle Plan. But first, I want to make sure we get some good old shippy boys right there. We, now, we don't own Libya, which it means we might have to attack someone for Libya later on. Ooh, we're going to need to do this as well. Well, we have got plenty of time. Let's make sure we do what we need to do first. I love Rome. Let's build up some civilian factories with the Pope. Let's see. 40%. Now, normally, I almost never, ever play Italy. I really don't like playing Zone usually, just because they're pretty... They're not strong. They're not like Germany strong. Even France maybe might be a little stronger. Maybe, maybe not. But I generally really do not like playing as Italy. But I'm making an exception. And I have not taken a look at this Navy yet so far. Um, what is all this stuff? Oh, my goodness. And we probably don't have a lot of fuel. Gonna need some of this. I don't use howitzers just because I don't really like them. Maybe in the next campaign I play, I will use them. And before we put any more things on here, so we got some regular infantry. That's actually not too bad. 18 combat with with engineers. That's not bad. We gotta make these guys a little bigger. Train one at a time. And put on the port. Uh, train. Let's go with 12. We'll split them up into two fronts because we might be a war with Austria-Hungary. We might be a war with France. I have no idea at the time of this recording. I like this, but we're gonna save that for later. And I usually like saving cavalry for big breakthrough moments. But I might not use them in this campaign. I don't know. Cool. And before we move on, Navy. So we have one Navy. That has eight battleships. Okay. Hmm. Taon de Revel. I like Revel. Uh, if we're going to get that, you might as well do this guy then. Do that. Train. Split off whenever you can. we going to need some early cruisers then. I don't... I, are these actually... Oh my goodness. Look at the ships. Oh my goodness. So what's, it, what's the difference? Like, there's literally no difference between us. They're both pre-dreadnoughts. I'm going to go with the Margarita class, because everyone, or at least a lot of people, like Margaritas. Uh, we're going to get us up to three. We have some planes going. We're going to need a lot of guns where we're headed to. Just make some convoys for now. I don't want to make any extra battleships, which cause us extra fuel. And, you know what? Let's let time go on, just because it's May 1st. And we're going to be out of fuel very quickly. Oh, no, no, no. And we also have disagreement with the Triple Alliance. Whatever. As well as... The Risorgimento. Oh, wow. Plus 10% political power gain. We get 1.3. Not bad. Not bad. Cool. I'm going to put you in your, in your own little theater. Like normal. Costs. Very nice. And this one. Let's see. How many? Br Brigada Alpini. Kind of like special horses, huh? Very cool. How many horse people do we have? Six. Oh, South Africa Act. The Union is formed. Well, good for them. The comet sighted. Our astronomers predict another push to the Earth of Halley's Comet. Every 75 years, this celestial body marked the beginning of disasters and scared uneducated peasants, but modern society seeks to study this cosmic phenomenon. And modern observatories and cameras will allow you to make high-quality images. An interesting phenomenon. I love more stability. We might use these guys. I'm not really sure at the time of this recording, because I almost love using them as, like, special breakthrough units. And almost anything. Uh, let's see. Kadarna. Something tells me I shouldn't use this guy. But I kind of want to. Oh, Diaz. Oh, he's pretty good in defense, though. He's pretty good in defense. I got defense. I love defense. Um, I'm going to go with more attack, though. Just because, uh, historically, and this, this, is, this is a great war. We might need as much help 
attacking as possible. Go do that. Early industrialization. Good. Invite Anton investors. I love the description. Good. Let time go on. Now, I don't remember historically. What year did Italy and the Turks go to war with each other? Ooh, King Ferdinand up in a plane. Very nice. Um, all these guys seem very... Not bueno, as some might say. Japan, Korean annexation. That's okay. You know what? Give it to you guys. Become... Infantry. That'd be fine with me. Uh, you guys... Ooh, Luigi. I love Luigi. There we go. And then... Ooh, you have too much. Spread it out. Share the wealth. Share the wealth of infantry divisions. Hey, we got plenty of political power. Um, Hills Fighter, I like that cavalry leader. Oh, there. Because, I, you know what? I'll still use cavalry. I don't want a bunch of cavalry right now. But I guess we can still use them. That'd be fine. Mountaineers. Actually. Hmm. Hmm. This is all going to be one front for now. You know what? So be it then. I could throw... You know what? Both of you are going to be under someone else. There you go. And uh, what can we do with this? Early mobilization? Ooh, at least we're not civilian economy, but still, man. Oh, what do we have here? Smooth talker. Infrastructure civilian factories might be good to do right now. Ooh, political power gain. I'm going to do Luigi. We might need that extra political power later on. 0.61, not bad. Early machine tools, cruisers. I guess we might as well grab that. Uh, concentrated 10, 10. More numbers, more green numbers mean muy bueno. Let's see. Mm. Now I gotta say that guy. Petro. Because cool. you... If I don't put the Hills Fighter for the Mountaineers, I'm doing something wrong. I would be tempted to do that, though. Uh, yes. And we need another Field Marshal. Promotion cost, promotion cost. He gets a little bit less experience, but you know what? We'll still accept him. We'll still like him for now. Now, I don't want to put everyone over here. Because we don't have enough stuff. Cool. Ooh, roads would be pretty good. Infrastructure. We'll do that one eventually. Develop colonial ports. I guess we don't have any colonies, so we got to wait for that. Uh, land auction wouldn't be bad. Army XP wouldn't be bad. Colonial ambition seems pretty good, and we can't do this because we have to be in the Great War. Sure, wait, hold on. No, no national focus prerequisites. Uh, okay. Hmm. Well, colonial ambition. So... Oh, let's try that one. Get more war support. And we get Scramble for Africa. Mm hmm. Well, we'll build up the Mountaineers because they'll be holding over there. Uh, you know what? I'm going to put you guys over here. We'll see what happens. And we definitely need to train our soldiers. Holy cow, we, we need to train our soldiers. Construction Uno. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, that's way too ahead of time. Way too ahead of time. Uh, can we do anything for armor? Not yet. That's really disappointing. Um, maintenance. Military police would be nice. Anything for infantry? Of course. Let's grab the motorized real quick. All right, guys. Go ahead and train if you need it. Which, let's be real, you all need it. We're completely out of fuel, which is pretty normal for us. And we only have nine civilian factories. Oh, my gosh. And we only make some more. Hey, revolution in Portugal. By early January, which is El Garbo. Please give me one moment, please. My apologies, I thought my cat was outside my door. Sometimes he is, sometimes he's not. Improved work conditions. Yeah, we might as well do that. Let's grab a, just a little bit more stability for now. That'd be kind of nice. And I've completely neglected my Air Force. Do we have an Air Force? We've got nine early fighters. Now, isn't that just adorable? Yes, it is. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And we should be done with our focus eh, relatively soon. 20 days, not bad. And they'll get some dispersed industry because, my goodness, we're going to need a lot of guns. Support equipment and fighters. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's going to be... Not super bueno. Um, going to do that. Let's go and repair whatever we have for now. Oh my goodness, our resources are garbage. Uh, at least we're getting some artillery. Nice. Colonial ambitions. Very nice. Revolution in Mexico. Good for you guys. Good for you. Disperse industry. Flexible foreign policy or claims on Libya. War with the Ottoman Empire. I kind of want to do that. I kind of really want to do that. Steal for the army. That's not bad. Oh, we get an extra research slot eventually. This stuff seems really, really useful. Uh, let's see. Get some more war support. So, let's do that one first, and we'll do the Alpenine Roads. Oh, let's do that too. Don't forget. Way too ahead of time. Gonna grab that. And just in case. Hmm, I really want to... I need more naval XP for my navy. I really want to make 1910 cruiser hulls. If that's the case, I'm gonna go ahead and do this. Hopefully we have our naval doctrine 
or we can naval invade. Tobruk? You know what? Let's not invade Tobruk. Oh, cool. Awesome. Benghazi, yes. Everyone loves Benghazi. Maybe we can invade from here as well as Thr Tripoli. Oh. And can we do... Might be too much supply there. Uh, I don't want to get into that naval theater. Uh, why are we limited here? Eh, we might lose a few, few, few divisions. Maybe not. Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe not. Well, we'll see what happens. Cool, let's do this first. Awesome. I love great battleship hulls. Probably can't even use them. Do we need... Yes. There we go. Cool. Very good. Very good. 1910 ships. Goodbye. Goodbye. Garbage. Trash. Garbage. Rapid fire guns. That's actually not too bad. We have level 2. And do we get some more rapid fire guns. Good. Oh, goodness. We need fire control systems, too. You know what? Take that off, then. Fire control. Um... Uh, I don't see fire control. Oh, I guess we probably have to research that then. Oh, claimed on Libya. Very nice. War with the Ottoman Empire. Let's do this one first. So, because I do want to go to war with the Ottoman Empire when they're fighting the Bulgarians and the Serbians and stuff like that. I think that'd be best. That'd probably be best. 0.63. 83% stability. Not bad. Slowly raising it up, and then we're probably going to grab military theorists. Wow, that sucks. Just 0.05. Is that it? Uh, let's see, more defense, 5%'s okay, speed's okay, 5% defense, even more defense. Mm, actually, before we check that, industrial concerns, eh, seems, we're pretty lacking, not gonna lie, this is pretty lacking, but happy 1911, my friends, it's already February 4th, we're going by as fast as possible. Given on what Serbia and these guys are doing, Balkan strategy, Agarian economy, Infrastructure, British oil agreements. Okay, okay. 0.64, very nice. 86% stability, I love it. Turreted secondary, better. What was I looking at? Oh, fire control. Oh, no. Do we seriously have to wait for that long? Early? Oh, no. God, no, no, no. Uh, I, we can't do that yet, then. Mm, better artillery? Sure. Yeah, how many ships does the Ottoman Empire have? Uh, that's me. Oh, they only have a few. They're probably the same. Oh, no, no. They have one to three. So if we were to duke it out with each other, we'd probably be okay. Let's go ahead and stop training. Just repair since we could probably have to save on fuel. Yeah, let's save on fuel a little bit. I think there's a mountaineer so we can throw some on there too. Fuel's going to be a little important. Alpenine roads. Steel for the army. Military. Ah, uh, let's grab this already. And then I'll do war for Libya. Probably. Maybe. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Nice. Scramble for Africa, just like everyone else. On time investments will be removed on September 2nd. So, building this up really didn't help us that much, which honestly kind of sucks, but whatever. Uh, oh, probably we need some field hospitals. Yeah, let's grab some field hospitals. We don't have a massive population. 40 million is not bad, but hmm, it ain't enough. We're doing well in artillery, which is good. Oh, let's raise it up. Lower that. Good, good, good. I actually have another... Um, you know what? We're going to keep him 18 combat with for now. That'll be okay. Make the cavalry just a little bit bigger. That'll be okay. And before I forget, check once again. Naval transport. We have total 10. So for some reason, that was because we weren't able to move. Whatever. Can you guys do something then? Can you guys come from there and also invade? Yes. Oh, get some more political power. I love it. And then can you guys do the same thing? Just two more. There you go. Benghazi. Cool. What are we going to do with this stuff? Industrial concerns. Maybe eventually smooth talker. Democratic performer. Plus 15% stability. Is nothing to laugh at. Since we've got it, let's go with Captain of Industry. We're going to build up roads probably eventually anyway. So that'd be kind of nice. July 20th. Two months away, man. I think not. There you go. That helps us out. Just a t tiny bit more. Just a tiny bit. Alright, let's do that. War with the Ottoman Empire. Probably. Mm, I I'm, I'm regretting that. No. Sanusi. Oh. Look at all that. Industrialization of the South. I'm sorry. I love building up factories early on. If I can avoid a conflict with the Ottoman Empire for now, I'd be so happy about that. Yeah, they got 
an assortment of divisions. I still have a lot of that. They have so much more fuel than us. Let's let's trade away for at least one fuel for now. The U.S., Russia, let's go to the Raj. There you go. Because we're going to need to stockpile some of this fuel so we can do some naval warfare. That'd be kind of nice. What is Serbia up to? Officer staff training. And we are on historical, so that's always good to remember. Free war artillery, good. That stuff can wait. 1911. Scout planes, 1912. That stuff can wait. We're getting that, which is nice. Military police would be good as well, but we probably don't need to defend too many areas yet. Let's grab some organization. Max entrenchment and entrenchment speed. Oh, it's going to take forever to do. That's going to take so long. And then we'll probably put some some artillery on our soldiers next. Promises of peace. We're done getting more stability, which is fine. Ban communism. We are pretty unaligned, which is kind of nice. Where can I go here? Proto-fascists or communists? Hmm. Or be at war, which we might actually be at war when we go to war with these guys. Officer staff training, getting more fuel. Love it. Love it. Love it. 34 factories, not bad. Keep building, keep building. Nice. Alright, let's go and do war with the Ottoman Empire. Let's see what happens. It's only 35 days, but you never know what might happen. And I'm going to save my political power. France occupies Fez. Stolypin assassination, cool. Yeah, we're going to wait to do what we can do here. Limited exports. Current ruling party is democratic. It would be a war. Huh. Mountain infantry. Good. Definitely going to use those guys this campaign. Anything else I can do here? No, that's all cap. No. Hmm. How about anti-air? Can we get... Eh, we have to wait. That sucks. Uh, we could do that. I suppose we might as well. I mean, we can't really extract too much more. Maybe a little bit more steel, which would be nice. Aluminum would be nice to get as well, but... Hmm. Alright, how are the ships? Are they all done repairing? Mona Lisa has been stolen. Well, that is not good. Field hospitals? Nice. Nice. Ah, oh, it's 226 days away. You know what? Just go ahead and grab it. We might as well at this point. Alright, guys. Jabal Shamar. Boat, Southern's line. Cool. So, the Italians have den been denied a colony in Tunisia and thus seek, must seek any territory available to her. The Turks are isolated and weak and seem to be the best possible target to liberate any new Italian colonies from. We could even perhaps earn some more territory in the course of the war. Italia Combatara. Combatara. Cool. And I want to see what's on the back. Okay. No longer get. Ah, no longer get investments, I see. Oh, terrible. I say, I say quite terrible. Maybe I've gone to war too early. Mm, I'm going to save this for later. And we can't do this because there has to be a great war. So, I could use a military factory immediately, probably. Aluminum, that's okay. Fuel. Nice. Steel. Let's grab this one. Steel for the army. Claim Libya. Well, this is probably way too early for us to do, but that's okay. Just in case, hopefully they don't have any, too much of a navy over there. Cool. Can we go ahead and launch the invasion? Italian invasion of Libya, an ultimatum was presented to the Ottoman government. Though Austrian inter through Austrian intermediation, the Ottomans replied with a proposal of transferring control of Libya without war. Maintaining a formal Ottoman suzerainty, the Italian refused, and the war did not declare. That seems kind of mixed here, but whatever. Oh, I, I can't wait. I can go to total mobilization, but I can't do war economy. Hmm. Hmm. God, I wish I could get more war support right now. Oh, what does this say? We need to seize Libya as soon as possible and not delay our intervention. Otherwise, the Ottomans will be able to hold the London Conference and demand reparations from us. Oh, no. Well, if that's the case, I really am not going to kill off my manpower yet. I could go there, but we need more world tension, which we don't have. I'm just going to go to partial mobilization then, because I can't afford anything else. Please invade successfully. Jaba oh, watch out. Jabal Shamar has been called in. And we, we took Tripoli. Great. Did, were they not defending this area? They were not defending this area at all. Oh my goodness. That is so not good for them. Go all the way. Link up. Just take everything you can. Um, this was probably one of the easiest inv uh, invasions I've ever done. Oh, we found some horses. Oh boy.
Oh, we're finding some boys there too. Oh, look at that. The Italian Navy is a mighty navy. If that's oh, now they're coming in. Now they're coming in. That's not good. I'm gonna go ahead, you guys just do all this. Alright, so you guys are over there. To all you guys. Come over here. Have a good time. Have a good time. We do that. Oh, we might get someone in circle there. Oh, Tobruk, that's not good. Stop doing that area. Do that area. We might be able to sink some of their convoys. Oh, we almost got encircled. Oh, we almost lost traction there. Oh boy. Oh, thank God he showed up. Woo! You guys hold. Um, hold for now. You guys hold as well. They've definitely shown up here, which really sucks. Hey, but we encircled a horse. I love it. Keep them in place. Oh, crap. Oh, actually, that's not bad. Keep them like that for now. Oh, are you kidding me, man? Seriously? The Agadir Crisis? Good. What do they need? And they lost another convoy. They're going to be losing all their convoys by the time I'm done with them. Come on. They can't be that strong, can they? Can we win here? Oh, actually, you guys help out. Push them back, push them back. God dang it, we got encircled. Agadir Crisis Resolved. Okay, well, then you guys hold on. Hold on. Hold the phone. You guys get up here. You guys come down here. And you guys come down here. Let's at least rescue these guys. That'd be good. As we are just sort of doing that, we're going to need a little bit more fuel. Mirage, Mexico. Keep it up. I mean, you can try to do that as much as you like, but Ottoman boys, you're going to go bye-bye. Oh, man. We have been completely encircled, but you know what? I am full of surprises. Ah, you don't like being encircled yourself, I see, huh? Come on, go to Tobruk. Okay, China is killing itself. That's okay. Uh, yes, war, more war support, please. Xinhai Revolution, good. Oh, these people have chosen incredibly poorly. Don't let them move. Do not let them move. Whatever we do, do not let them move. Come on, get to Tobruk. We got it. We got supplies through here. And we cut off their supplies. Ottomans offer truce. There we go, my friends. The Turks have been pushed to the point of surrender. They are offering us Libya and a temporary occupation of the Dodecanese Islands. Though no doubt we can make that permanent. These are great terms for a short war. We can push for more, but perhaps this piece is enough? Beautiful, my friends. Look at that. I was actually somewhat doubting my ability to wage war, but hey, you know what? We won. Great job, guys. Uh, you probably don't want to attack there. And then you guys will come down there. Good. You know what? And we did a great job. I forgot we even had planes. Forgot about it. Now we've got guys all around here. I really don't want to go to war with these guys again. I don't want to. Hey, but at least we use our actual army as well. I'm feeling pretty good about that. I'm not really sure where to put these other guys. You know what? For now, just come hang out in Rome so we don't get naval invaded. And then you guys... I'm obviously going to need more divisions on every single front. But, hmm, I think this front probably going to need a little bit more strength. But you know what? I'm glad we won, and we did a great job. I think we did a fantastic job. Cool. Now we don't know what to do with this. Hmm. I'll probably save this for next time. Let me know in the comments below. Should we do a reapproachment with the Entente or Germany? If we go down with Germany, if we do Germany, let's see, either one, either one. Cool. If we do that, we get a core on Savoy and Corsica, which I think is actually really nice. Because, you know, Savoy, it's properly Italian. And Corsica, I think that just looks nice. That just looks nice. Or we can do a reapproachment with the Entente, which we get uh, a core on South Sutorol, Istria. Uh, that's not bad. I'm not sure. Agree with opposition, destroy radical opposition. If we go with the Entente, we get a core on Sutorol, as well as Istria, which is okay. Pretty historical. London Pack is okay, because we, if we go down that way, we basically go down with the Entente as well, and we get claims on someone else, on something else. Zara and Dalmatia, or we go down with Agree with Opposition, become more of a democracy, which is okay. Create our own faction with the Rome Pact. 
get more factory repair speed, land for construction speed, we get more stability, we get manpower, army XP, we can send volunteers, we get Greece to really like us, and we get a war with the Ottoman Empire again. So let me know in the comments below which way we should take, because if I do this focus now, we might have to choose which one we do, so we're going to not do that for now, but let's do military industry. So, very nice. Oh, actually, ooh, actually we should have waited then to get the extra research slot, but that's okay. Opposition strikes. The opposition Republican Party announced anti-militarist demonstrations and the demands and strikes in connection with the invasion of Libya. They demand to stop the policy of expansionism and restore the democratic government that was broken up several years ago. Oh my gosh, I hate Republican traditions. Oh, why do you hurt the Italian nation? Like, bruh, like, what the heck? Um, yeah, battleships. Now we're back down to, well, at least we have 14, this could be worse. We only get 0.96, which is, you know, I'm kind of glad I took the other path earlier than because of that garbage. Alright, let's see what we're at. We have a piece of artillery. We need some support equipment. We need some fighters, which is doing fine. Infantry equipment is doing fine. Before we get too far, let's go and do this. Yeah, that's actually really good. Thank you. Civilian oversight. Very nice. Let's see. Let me duplicate this. Thick Italian. Good. And what can we do here? At least we're on war, or, or not war, not war economy, but partial mobilization, which is pretty darn nice. Smooth talker, daily democracy. I might just go for that 50% more stability right now. That could help us out. Screw it. I don't want to read anything else. self reach perhaps we'll establish a colony. Maybe, maybe not. Ah, uh, Republican opposition. I really don't like it. Now we can do that one. I really don't know which path we should take, but I will know at the beginning of the next episode. Uh, let's see. Oh, let's go and cut these guys over. Good. And Division Alpine. At, at the very least, make you guys like that. At the very least. Ooh, field hospitals, yes. Support artillery, yes. Recon. Ooh, recon armored car. Let's go with regular recon. The Mountaineers will be the special forces of our group. Which would be very nice. Very nice. Oh, god dang it, we need motorized as well. Oh boy, that is not going now. There we go. I'm not gonna take one off of here. I'll take one off of here though. There we go. Uh, steel. Eh, do we really? Uh, I, I don't want to hurt our production. We have two over here, which is nice. Military industry. Great. More factories. I love factories. We have to be at war to do this next. Which? Oh, we get to go to war economy immediately. Oh. Well then. Wait. It requires one of the following. Okay. Del land auction. You know what? We could probably do that first. So, I love the description. More land auction, please. Thank you. At least we're getting one more, I guess. Point. At least we get one stability. One stability. I wish we got one stability. But happy new year, my friends. 1912. We get one political power day. We're only out 15,000 infantry equipment, which is not bad. The Lena Massacre is also good. And we are on historic. Also, Serbia. I've already won my war against the Ottomans. Oh, establish Regency. So, you you guys. Good luck. And I do need to place the Ottomans someday. I will place the Bulgarians and the Romanians. Do you have a focus stream in one? Uh, Kind of, not really. Yeah, not really too much. I might play the Romanians, maybe someday, I don't know. And the Greeks. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much the same one. Not really unique focus tree. However, China does. So this is a Chinese focus tree, which is looking kind of kind of weird, kind of big-ish. But the Republic of China, you guys, actually, you all share the same focus tree, huh? Okay. But Japan has a different focus tree, which is actually very nice. I'll probably play as Japan as well, just to warn everyone here if you want to continue watching my channel. I will probably play as Japan as well, so please continue watching my channel. But you know, with that war, at least we went to partial mobilization. That's pretty good. I like that. Come on, keep building, build, 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 build. We're almost done with that one, then we can start making some more military factory notes. Because 45 factories, that's, that's not much. That's really not much. Hey, good job. Good job, guys. Pat on the back. Pat on the back for everyone. We could do that. I'm gonna wait till we have a few more factories before we do that. Uh, colonial divisions in Libya, that's kinda nice. Develop artillery. Combat aviation, air doctrine, air bases, battleships, some more naval XP. Well, let's get modernization of Colonial Corps. Get some colonial divisions. Uh, there'll probably be like six combat with. Colonial divisions really aren't that big. Ooh, the end of the Sin High Revolution. Thank God the tea is safe. Now that is a nice a Republic of China. Ooh, analytical engine, very nice. Ooh. Oh, yes. Finally. 
I can actually make better ships. And we are... Oh, we're still out of fuel. Oh, God, I forgot about this. God dang it. Move over here. Go ahead and train. Actually, you know what? Come over here and do that. Sinking of the Titanic. Oh, no. Oh, well. Cool. Now we're going to have really no fuel. Go ahead and repair everyone if you need to. Oh, wow. You really took care of that really quickly. Nice, nice, nice. And with all eight battleships being made or being repaired or training, we can only get point... A quarter of a point a day. The Olympic Games we will attend. It's only 1912, but that's because... Ooh, the Balkan League. The only reason why we're not any further in the game is just merely because, well, we were busy. Actually, I didn't even use these. I should have used the horses in Libya. But whatever, we already did a really good job over there. Cool, what are we going to do next? Hmm, and industry stuff is always pretty good to do. Ooh. B oh, uh, Beretta. Oh, my goodness. Ooh, that's not too bad either. Ooh, let's go with that one first, just because I'll be making shifts this entire time while waiting to get more stuff done. How much steel do we need? Four more. We need four more, so let's grab at least one steel. That'd be important. Uh, we'll do it with the Swedes. There we go. There we go. Help production out. And here we shall do machine gun defense. Good. Great. Artillery is looking awesome. Oh! There we go. There's another war. Awesome. But you know what? Let me know in the comments below. Should we go with the Entente? Should we go with Germany? Please let me know in the comments below. But that's pretty much going to be today's episode. If you like today's episode, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you are new. Check out my Discord link in the descri description below. Uh, where we hang out on Discord a whole bunch. And I guess I will see you all tomorrow. Thank you very much for watching. And have a great rest of your day.